Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. As as I told you that we'll be going through the revision of the second chapter. So this is the review video of the second chapter. In this, we'll be going through the important formulas. So one of the important, the few important formulas in Fourier transform is what is Fourier transform, guys? Fourier transform of f of x is nothing but x1 of omega is equals to integral minus infinity to infinity x1 of t e to the power of minus j omega t dt. Inverse Fourier transform is x1 of t is equals to 1 by 2 pi integral minus infinity to infinity x of t e to the power of j omega t dt so we, so we can sorry for that so we can expect one problem in between these two guys Fourier or inverse Fourier and the general formula I hope everyone knows this it has real part and imaginary part so magnitude is nothing but this square plus this square whole under root face is nothing but the imaginary part by real part linearity property linearity property is a x1 of t plus b x2 of t when we apply Fourier transform for that, we are going to get a x1 of omega plus b x2 of omega. Similarly, time shifting property x1 of t minus t naught. For that, if we apply Fourier transform, we are going to get x1 of omega e power minus j omega t naught x1 of t plus t naught. If we apply Fourier transform for that, we are going to get x1 of omega e to the power of plus j omega t naught. For frequency shifting, this is the formula guys for time shifting. This is the formula for time reversal. This is the formula for differential property this will be the formula i hope everyone we derived all these formulas guys so that's the reason why i'm just showing you the formulas integral property this will be the formula duality this hilbert's transform this and inverse hilbert's transform this so i hope at least four be perfect with at least four properties of Fourier transform guys because the most seen question in question papers is that write any four properties of Fourier transform thank you thanks for watching